All right, it's Steve Barwick here for www.thesilveredge.com and I'm making this short video to answer one of the most frequently asked questions that I get from new customers. And that question is, can you use the new microparticle colloidal silver generator to make batches larger than one quart? And of course the answer is, you certainly can, as I'm going to demonstrate for you here today in this short video. Uh, there are basically three things you have to remember when you're making batches larger than one quart and we'll go over each of them one at a time. What you're looking at right now is a one quart glass canning jar and uh, that one quart jar will produce about seven to ten parts per million after a three hour running time. Okay, That's your general rule of thumb and that's the first thing you have to remember. If you want to make a larger batch for every quart of water, you let the generator run three full hours. So here we have a one gallon cookie jar, and you can see the generator's going like crazy. We'll let that run 12 hours, because why? It's a one gallon, that means it's four quarts, and every quart needs a three hour running time. Okay, over here is our gallon and a half cookie jar. We're using that for a production container gallon and a half has six quarts three hours times six quarts means an 18 hour running time all right so that's rule number one three hours for every quart three hours of running time for every quart of water all right uh, the next rule is when you're making larger than one quart batches you have to extend the length of the silver rods that's because you have greater water volume in a larger container like that. If you look at the silver rods in this container, you'll see that they run from the bottom of the generator down to about an inch from the bottom of the production container. Same over here. Here's our big uh, gallon and a half batch. I'm going to zoom in on it. And you look at the silver rods, they run all the way down to about an inch and a half from the bottom. And all you have to do to get larger silver rods like that is simply go to www.thesilveredge.com and order them online. You can order a 5 foot roll of pure .999 fine silver wire and then you cut it to length as you need it. Whatever the length of your production container is, you cut the silver rods appropriately. Okay, That's the second thing you have to remember. And the third thing you have to remember is to make sure the mouth of the jar is small enough that your colloidal silver generator can't fall in. You don't want to end up electrocuting yourself while making colloidal silver. So as you can see, in both of these cases here where we're using the larger production containers, the mouth of the jar is smaller than the colloidal silver generator itself, so the generator cannot fall in. That's very important. Those are the three basic rules to remember. If you want to make larger than one quart batches, it's three hours running time for every one quart of steam distilled water. You have to lengthen the silver rods appropriately to fit the container. Okay, And you have to make sure that the, that the uh, generator itself can't fall into the container. Make sure the mouth of your production container is small enough that the generator sits on top of it with no chance of falling in. Those are the three basic rules for making batches larger than one quart. If you have any questions, you can always call us at 1-888-528-0559 or visit our website at www.thesilveredge.com. Uh, this is Steve Barwick here for The Silver Edge, and I thank you very much.